I'm just gonna go out on a limb and say it's a store for party. Party store? It sounds like my kind of place right there. Where can I go to make party? <laughs> Not even make go party, just party like, oh, they have one here. <laughs> I'll just take <laughs> this with me. Is it like, do you wanna shop at the party store in my pants? Oh. Kind of thing, like there's room for two or I don't know. <laughs> if you look around like, enough, you might get a face full of confetti. I don't think it's like I balloons and confetti. Like this is the real party where it's like where it's popping at. bottles with models. Yeah, some sex move. Yeah. Like, like oh, how was last night, Joe? Oh, I gave her the party store. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm there. pretty sure this Take is just there. like a liquor store. Well, that would make sense. There's a spectrum here, so we could go like, oh, these are just like cookies, like some fudgy cookies. We or could be it's totally benign and not even talk about what's in the toilet. A polite way to warn your mother-in-law that the meal she made you gave you the fudgies. I think it's someone who yeah. really likes fudge, just like a foodie for the fudge. Susan, I love your son so much, and I thank you for welcoming me into your home. I have the fudgies. <laughs> and you guys might want to vacate the first floor. The leading cause of cholera in Michigan is kids being confused about which fudges they can eat and which they can't. It's the Wolverine State. That's the nickname for a Wolverine, I bet you. I was thinking like Daisy Dukes, like fudgies, because they're so, they like go up your butt crack. If this isn't poop related, I'm gonna be really upset. It's gonna give me a case of the fudgies. Maybe it's like a go-getter. Like yeah. Like a woman who's always on her car phone because she's so busy and like yeah. done. Two tracking. Is it insult? You two timing two tracker. It's like a stalker who has two women in mind. Are you cooler if you are a three tracker? He's kind of spreading himself too thin. He's tracking both of their movements but like much like a comedy where a guy is dating two girls, he like gets their address mixed up and like wears the wrong costume to stalk one when he's looking for the other. And it's or it's a multitasker, cause he, it's like, oh, one track mind. No, no, I'm a two tracker. And like gets the GPS mixed up and like when he cuts the, their hair when they're sleeping, he gets it all mixed up and it's just like he's, he needs to choose <laughs> one woman to stalk. It's much easier. Please make that a romantic comedy right now. I think this is probably puking. Chuke. With chunks. Oh. It's like the chupacabra on his off day. Like, chupacabra's my dad. I'm chuke. <laughs> Choke someone until they puke. Obviously. That's clearly what it is. Yeah. I bet chuke does like hella bong rips. <laughs> or like knows how to make a bong out of an apple. <laughs> Yeah, so that, real. That's, that's the double-edged sword of <laughs> chuking somebody, is that you're usually right in the Make line sure of fire. Make sure you chuke from behind. Exactly. That is, that is standard chuking form. I got so wasted last night, I sucked the blood of a thousand goats, whoa! <laughs> <laughs> that is a medieval town in a um, little uh, kingdom of mice. This is when you're drunk and you can't tell the difference between the two. Has that happened to you? Yep, that's what it is. Yep. Adorable. An idiot. Not very smart. It could be like a clue situation where it's like, oh man, if you pull out the first edition copy of Moby Dick from this bookshelf, it will turn. It's a door wall. I feel like door wall could also mean to C block someone. I was just thinking that. An undecisive person. You don't it's know what you are. Oh, yeah. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> the door was open. Was the door was open. Was she in was there. flirting. And then you went up and told her about my toy troll collection. And now she doesn't want to go home with me anymore. I'm guessing this is a derivative of ecstasy. <laughs> but not quite as good. <laughs> this is some douchebag, what he calls his girlfriend's period. Like, oh, you know, she's hitting the high lows again, crying, laughing, crazy, mad, angry. High lows, okay, so let me tell you a little bit about high lows. Tell high me. lows is a standard offense in basketball. Wait, when you push guys, he goes up by free throw, you get in the ball, that pulls one big after him, he's one more pass to the other big, he's got his leg. So high lows, we're just talking about the offense, probably not Michigan, because they have a lot of shares. That's what they're talking about. No. 
for 75 will be the high today and the low will be 30 and our high low is 35. <laughs> Weathermen don't have to talk like that. <laughs> this is like when people check in with each other, it's like, hey, what was your high today? What was your low? What's your high low? Yeah! You know, Cause everyone's so friendly there. <laughs> people want to know that shit. It, oh my God, is it, um, what's it called? Wedgies? You you go, high low? You take the lowest part of someone and you rip it up high and then they hit the lowest of emotional lows. Do wedgies actually happen anymore? I feel like I've only ever Oh yeah, I've only been them. there when I've given someone a wedgie. Oh really? I feel like <laughs> I've, only, I've only ever seen them happen in cartoons. So I don't oh, even no, know no, what no, a no, real no, wedgie no. would they look are like. real. 